Hey guys, welcome back to another SUP Border video, a little mini family SUP adventure video actually. Myself, Lucy and Izzy have just come back from a really great trip to Northern France in Brittany and we met a really cool couple that are into water sports just like us. They do a lot of paddle boarding, a lot of surfing, a lot of windsurfing and they actually run a local paddleboard school out there. It's called Les Enfants de l'Ecote. Really apologise about my French, it's probably not pronounced very well at all. The link is in the description below. Um, and they said to us, do you want to come paddling with seals? Well, if it involves paddling, wildlife and going with locals, I'm well up for that sort of stuff. So they took us out on actually one of their SUP groups, which is where you go offshore to a small group of islands and you see the local seal population. And it really was a great afternoon out. They taught us how to interact with the seals safely so we don't stress the seals out. We learn a lot about the local area and really just a super afternoon out, which is why I've got to share this video with you. Now the paddle was actually a couple kilometers out to sea. The good thing is Gillam would take the rescue boat, so just in case anything would happen, you always have that extra backup. So where all these seals are living is on these small rocky islands. They're obviously fishing and hunting around the local area. The water clarity is amazing around here. And it didn't take long for us to arrive and there was already seals inquisitively coming around us in the water. As you can see by all of these rocks, they're perfect for seals to hang out as the tide is going out, because that's what Gillen was telling us. They fish when the tide is in, and then as the tide starts to drop out, they climb onto a small, weedy, rocky island, and then the tide goes out and they're left lying on the rocky island until the tide comes back in again, and then they go hunting again. So they're very, very lazy. They haven't got very far to climb out of the water to do a bit of sunbathing. Here Gillam is telling us how to sit down or lie down on our boards so when the seals are on the rocks they don't feel threatened and also giving them a good distance when they're on the rocks. We had a quick break on the main rocky island, played around with some octopus, which is great to see. Really amazing creatures and so intelligent. You can see this seal here trying to get his back flipper just out of the water to dry it all off. Some of the seals like this one here, we could actually get a little bit closer to because Gillam actually knew this seal as a pup and he's very used to and comfortable with people paddleboarding alongside his little rocky outcrop. But again, this is where local knowledge and paddling with somebody who knows the area and knows the seals makes such a difference, how you can have an interaction with wildlife and not stress them out. But near the end of our paddle session, me and Lucy were desperate to get in the water as it was so clear for a quick swim and a cool off. And it didn't take long, as soon as we were in the water, some very inquisitive little seal came up to check us out. 
definitely the icing on the cake, having a little swim with a seal. You can see how much they just look like slightly chubby dogs under the water, just lying there wondering what we are. So there it was, it was all over. I really want to say a big thank you again to Gillam and Fanny. They are a great group of people and definitely a great knowledge about the area. If you are visiting Brittany and you're into paddleboarding, definitely look those guides up and definitely try and get yourself on one of those tours. A lot of fun, a lot of fun. But until next time, we'll see you on another Supboarder video. Happy paddling. <laughs>